All right, the stream is live, and you should. Wrong. Everyone. Okay. Moderators, can you please put the subject matter as VTube Grum's VTuber debut plays Star Citizen? And starting chief chat. Hello everyone, starting our stream now on Twitch and Chief Chat debut of my VTuber avatar. And data data K40, I can't pronounce the name. I'm sorry, data. He made this rig. He made this VTuber rig. So Here we go. All right, I'm going to tweet this out too. Uh, we got some pretty good attendance today, I think. Oh, everyone's like, where's the maid? Where's the maid? Don't worry. Don't worry. This is the test avatar. There you are, Data 4, four OK. Thank you so much for making this. Uh, yes, this is the, the test model. And if and based on this, we the maid is coming. Don't worry. I would much prefer to stream as the maid anyways. <laughs> cat ears i know all right i'm going to i'm going to I'm going to put this on i'm going to tweet this out Live now on Twitch. <laughs> All right, live now on Twitch. Grums Ember. Debut of my VTuber avatar also streaming on Star Citizen because why not? Join now. Okay, tweet was sent. <clears throat> and, uh, oh shoot, I didn't get this quite set up yet. I'm going to need a keyboard. And I need to get over here and get the Twitch stream going, stream manager so I can see chat. I am using a, a iPhone uh, as a webcam, which has higher uh, tracking ability than a Logitech. And we are gonna go ahead and jump into Star Citizen here. Joining me today is my son, Kiri. That's not his uh. real name. You shoot me nicely. I don't have thick skin. Oh, Giga, thank you. Thank you for thinking the avatar is adorable. Um, this is the test Abby. This is the, the dev Abby. We also have a the, the maid Abby that was promised, and that's coming too. Thanks to uh, Dita for making this rig, and the art was provided by a good friend of mine <clears throat> who made my original Grumps avatar. And so he, he also did the, the upcoming made outfit debut. So today we're going to do something a little different. We're streaming Star Citizen, which is uh, infamous for being one of the longest crowdfunding games in existence. And I was an early, or an early backer of this. I was actually, I think, a Kickstarter backer or, or just soon after, like really early. Early enough that, that my name doesn't look weird. Like my handle's WildSpark, right? And, um, <clears throat> so this is, um, 
this is an interesting game. And when I when I tried it, there was nothing to it except um, I could walk around the hangar and see my ship. And that was, you know, that was kind of, and, and it was at all at 5 FPS. So it was like, I felt very sad. Testing out the expressions here. And, um, yeah, it made me feel, the frame rate made me feel like this. And, but, you know, it's grown since then. And um, a community member gave me a starter pack, a Mustang starter pack, which I had. And it was, it was awesome because it was awesome that someone gave that to me. But I, I never logged in. I didn't use it. And until just recently, last week, I actually downloaded the game and I logged in for the first time. And I was so, and I, all I did was <laughs> figure out how to wake up and, and walk around and then get into a ship, and then um, <clears throat> it was it was interesting because it was so much more than just the hangar I'd seen before, and the frame rate was much improved. I mean, the frame rate's still crap. Don't get me wrong. I mean, they're doing a lot here. Um, they're drawing quite a bit. I mean, I've never seen an engine do anything like this before, so that that's pretty impressive. But I was um, impressed enough that I really wanted a redeemer you know, which was a community drawn ship way back in the day. And I guess it, it's about to come out. It's in redesign and there's an upgrade path. And another person in the community helped me out with an upgrade path for that. So I, if I bought a constellation Andromeda, which we're going to see here, and we are going to, to give that a shot. Uh, so, and then when the redeemer comes out, I'll, up, I'll upgrade to the redeemer pack. And of course, um, I don't know if people are comfortable with me saying who who helped me out here, but thank you very much for that. So I'm I'm here. I'm in a party apparently with my son, but we've got a problem. We don't know how to. <laughs> Ronan says, "Who who else wants to pinch Grums' cheeks?" Show of hands. Can I get angry? I don't know if I can make an angry face. <laughs> so. <laughs> This is great because I don't have to I don't have to shave or you know put on my actual real life made outfit for stream. I can just use a VTuber. All right, but we need the community's help because we don't know how to actually uh, join up together. Kiri and I want to to join up together, and so I'm at the menu screen here, and I'm just going to visit location, and then he, I guess he's got to fly to me. Is that the first challenge? All right, so the loading screen takes forever. It's kind of like Anthem in that regard. Yeah, so uh, Kazake101 says, log into an open universe. We're in a persistent universe. And then meet up at a station. Uh, the issue is that um, there's a bug in which he tried to like join my party or whatever, and he's like stuck on another star system, but his ship is here on where I am. So he can't reach. What's I'm that? on the ship like right now. It's just taking two minutes. You said that ten minutes ago. <laughs> uh, it'll be here eventually. Okay. So I'm at CRU L5 right now, and you're at Arcorp, I think, right? Yeah, I'm at Ar I'm at Arcorp, and maybe I'm we... just waking up here. Yeah, maybe we could both fast travel to a cluster of asteroids or something. Well, it's not fast travel. You actually have to fly, right? Oh yeah, my bad. Quantum travel. I keep saying it's fast travel. Okay, so it took me forever to figure out how to get up out out of bed, but apparently you push the F key, and then you get a menu like this that's kind of floating in the air, and then you get up. And uh, this is, you know, I this computer is doing a lot. It's doing the face tracking, the VTuber animation. It's encoding my stream and it is um, running Star Citizen probably one of the most graphically intensive games ever or you know you can argue whether or not it's optimized or not it's doing a lot I I'll tell you as a game developer this engine does things that it's attempting to do things that nobody else would um, but you know but this is this I'm very pleased that my rig's able to handle all of this at the same time and I got to thank our sponsors, partners, AMD for that, for providing this hardware for development. 
this is what we develop on and I just wanted to uh, you know I guess if I'm gonna be a proper VTuber I got to give a shout out to our sponsors right so they they, they did provide this computer and that's right, Giga. Star, Star Citizen runs on a heavily modified Amazon Lumberyard engine, which used to be the Crytek engine. And there was a big lawsuit, and I think they settled it. Um, I guess I'm legally obligated to mention my, our, our sponsors. On Ember, we have them right on the, the login screen. But, you know, uh, everybody does that. All game companies usually have partnerships with either NVIDIA or AMD, uh, and they and they usually agree to put the logo somewhere. So that's what we've done. But this is the first time I've, I've thanked them and mentioned them on stream, but there you go. So this is not our game for people tuning in. This is not Ember, this is Star Citizen. Um, but it, as being another space crowdfunded game, I wanted to check it out. I've been a long time fan of Chris Roberts when I was a kid playing his Wing Commander games. And so I was very grateful to the community for providing me with a starter pack to, to try this out. And then I went ahead and I, I bought a ship and uh, we're about to try this out. So, uh, do I have a cat face? So how's my VTuber avatar? This is my VTuber debut. So this is the first time, you know, that we've, we've done this and a uh, community member Dita made this for me. Art was provided by a friend of mine How's this look? How's my VTuber avatar? Watching chat now. The eyes are odd and the mouth isn't synced. Sigh. I look creepy. Am I falling into the uncanny valley? Yeah, I think I have to adjust my, my blink sensitivity. I don't know. I'm, I'm new at this, all right? This is my first day as a VTuber. Jeez, God. Have some mercy. All right, so you, I guess you wake up in these apartments here, and uh, maybe it's my glasses. Okay, if I if I move my glasses up, is the eye tracking any better? I'm I'm blinking now. I'm closing my eyes, and I'm opening my eyes, and I'm closing my eyes, and I'm opening my eyes. Okay, so hopefully the, uh, the tracking's a little better because the glasses frames aren't in the way. Okay, so you wake up in your apartments, your glorious cyberpunk hive. And I don't know where I am. I'm in the Stanton system. I guess it's the only star system that Star Citizen has made so far. I don't know how many they've promised to make. And uh, let's see. Let's see here. Oh no, no, no Grums plushies. No, this is this is bad territory here. We don't we don't want Grums plushies. That's a no 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 no. Am I shaking my head? I can't tell. No no no. <laughs> what if I do it really fast? I don't know how this face tracking stuff works. Now I'm dizzy. Okay, take a look at the window opposite the elevator. Oh, there's the cityscape. There is, that's, that's huge. I mean, it gets huger. I have been to the hangar and I have taken off once, but I haven't done anything or gone anywhere. So I know, I know what's out there and you guys are gonna get to see that too. You know, technically, I should thank NVIDIA, too, because even though this is an AMD PC, uh, there is a 2070 Super in this from NVIDIA. But I but I have an, uh, a second AMD rig where AMD's provided a 6700 XT, and the frame rate's much faster in Star Citizen on that. Obviously, it's one generation ahead of this card, so. Uh, but this is the 2070. I'll just, I'll just say that for clarity. All right, so we need help. Uh, you know, if I pull up the star map here, I'm still getting used to all this. Uh, like this threw me. Like when you pull up the star map, you don't see anything. You gotta like actually like scroll the mouse way out in order to see anything. And I guess I'm here at. Uh, oh, geez, where am I? 
Am I at Comare or at Art Corp? Like, I don't know how to read this map. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Mr. BC Walker. Loves the Avatar for its S-posting potential. I do have other outfits. I have another outfit coming. The, the one I promised everyone. Now try headbanging? Okay. Bakasura-chan says headbang. So I'm headbanging now. I don't know if that worked at all. Okay, when uh, OT1 says when looking at the map, double right-clicking will zoom all the way out. Okay. And left-clicking will zoom on location. So I'm in a party with Kiri, but where is Kiri? I don't see him on my map. We've been trying to figure this out. And Kiri, do you have your ship yet? Uh, yeah, I have my ship. I'm out of the dock right now. Okay, so you're, oh, okay, you're out of the dock. So he, he, the first job, our first task is to rendezvous because we're going to try to pilot a, a multi-crew. We're going to try to pilot a, 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 a constellation together. Constellation Andromeda, I think it's called. Okay, head banging doesn't work. It breaks everything. Good to know. And I guess the eyes need work. Maybe it's my sensitivity settings. I don't have any flight sticks. I, I am I am flying with a mouse. I am mousing. Mouse control. Okay, so yeah. So Kiri, you're, you're headed to uh, where I am, which is... Um, oh, jeez. Um... How about we meet in the middle? So you're at R Corp and I'm at CRU L5. How about we meet at like H U R L4? I don't even know if there's a station there. We could be stranded without fuel. Uh, I'm checking it right now. It says there's an R and R at the stop. Let's ask the community. Any Star Citizen fans out there? Is there a midpoint? Where Where are you flying from? Uh, CRU L5. That sounds like a splendid location. So you're it's here not. at CRU L5. And uh, so, and I'm here at Arc Corp. Arc Corp's here, right? Yeah. So, midpoint for us would be H U R L 4. Mm, yeah, I think so. And there's a station there, looks like. The melodic, owned and operated by Rest and Relax, this station offers plenty of amenities for space weary travelers. Meet at Ember, that's funny. Is that a station we can dock and meet at? Is this a real thing? I, I don't want to go someplace and be out of fuel. Anybody play this game? Okay. Kazaki says yes. Uh, Giga Bear says it's a standard r, &R station. Okay, so you got that, Kiri? We're going to meet at uh, HURL4. Okay. I'll set my route to I'm going to see if I can quantum travel right to it. I can't set my route, apparently, from this part of the star map. I gotta be in the ship, I think. Alright, so let's get, get, let's, let's do it. Let's get to a ship. Call the elevator. I love how every, every button attempts to be real here. To the point of, you, you really have to, like, find the right button. And earlier this morning when I was testing, I got into this elevator with another player and we kind of fought over the control panel, like shoved each other out of the way. Like, how does the game resolve that? Like, who gets to determine where you go? Is this PvP elevator writing? PV I think you should PvP in the elevators to determine who gets to determine the ultimate destination. I guess it's like real life, right? You can either kill him and choose your desti destiny, or you can be polite and, and you know, let them push the button first or something. Yeah, kill him. I, that's what I do when I get into an elevator. I, I kill the other person so that I can choose my destination first. All right, so here we are. I guess this is one of the main hub areas. 
that a player or an NPC? I don't know. I've had some interesting bugs already. I actually came to this plaza and there was nobody here once and then they started loading in one at a time. And then I went to the spaceport and the tram stopped at the spaceport and there was uh, nothing there. And then five minutes, I turned around and five minutes later there was something there. Are you traveling there now, Kiri? Uh, yeah. 16 million kilometers away. 16 million kilometers. Okay. So... So I don't know where I'm going here. I guess I gotta go to Arcourt Plaza to get to the spaceport. If I remember correctly from my... My earlier hijinks. I think... I think it's hilarious that I'm VTubing this. I always wanted a VTuber. Kiri helped me test it out, did the QA on it. Oh, no, no. It's it's not the stream that's 30 FPS. It's Star Citizen. <laughs> it's the game. Dude, this, this game is just so graphically heavy. I, I don't know where to go. I guess over here. All right, and I think if I remember, it's down here. I went to the hangars before. I mean, look at this. This feels like a real busy airport. And these boards, are they real? Is this like, no, this can't be real. There's no commercial flights, right? I know this is more like a simulation than a game, but that, that I don't buy that. Alright, so I'm trying to get to the hangar, Kiri. Uh, oh, wait, I gotta get to the space station first. So I gotta take the tram. This place is big. I'm almost at the, um, the HUR thing right now. Okay. Well, you've had more, more time flying than I have. I haven't flown. I took off. That's what I did. Although I remember your first takeoff last night when we tried it out. You, you flipped uh, your ship upside down and... You lost, you lost a wing or something. <laughs> OT1 says it's actually CPU dependent. That's interesting, because um, I have the same CPU in a second AMD rig with an AMD 6700, and the frame rate was smoother, but you know not. The first time I tried this, I got stuck in the tram and had to kill myself. I had to ask in chat, how do I respawn? And they said, hold down the delete key until you die. Luck hopefully that won't happen this time. Hopefully. I'll try to give you, a view, uh, give you guys a view of the city here as we fly through it. This is, an, I guess, an air tram. Flies through the city. It's pretty cool. Okay, I'm at the station now. Did you land? Uh, no, but I just finished my quantum travel. I'm heading over there with thrusters now. Okay, so we had this problem last night where we got you to a destination, but you couldn't land, and you asked for clearance, but then every pad that you tried said that you had to clear the pad or be banned or something? Um, I think impound my ship or something. I think that was it. So we got to make sure that doesn't happen. So when they do the clearance thing, they tell you what pad to land at? Yeah, but I couldn't hear at the time. And even though we tried every pad, none of it worked. So I'm going to see if it works this time. GigaBear says when you request clearance, you get a specific pad. What if you forget what that pad is? There's a highlight on it. There was, we couldn't find the highlight. We were looking for it. I guess we'll find out here. We're docking at the spaceport. I was checking out YouTube channels for Star Citizen, and I noticed that I didn't see it on any like major channels regularly, but it's on a ton of smaller channels. And I thought that was interesting. 
Bakasura says you might be able to abort and request clearance again. The Riker okay. Memorial Spaceport. Is that a Star Trek reference? I love all these ads. Oh, Riker was a fan? Oh, no. So he passed away? Oh, that's sad. Okay, now I'm bummed out. All right. Uh, well, apparently, if you want to know where to go, you got to read the signs. The the signs are all functional. They they tell you what's going on, and that helped me find the spaceport the first time. I just followed the signs. So I think I think I'm down here. Oh, I worked this time. I can see an actual icon for where I'm supposed to dock. Thank you guys or God uh, for mentioning that. A little more information that Giga gave me. I guess it was the spaceport is named after a backer citizen, Sen Senreicher, a member of a German fan community, passed away in 2018. Oh, that's, that's, that's sad. Um, all right, let's go ahead and retrieve the ship. Yeah, so this time when I requested for um, clearance to land, they actually highlighted the dock this time, so that's nice. Uh, it says claim. What does that mean? I don't have the retrieve icon. I think that's if your ship is far away on some other planet and you need to recall it. So that's what I had to do with my Aegis. This one is at our core. 27 minutes! This isn't gonna work. Oh, is it because I logged out in space and I died? Okay. I have another one that's stored. I have I have some small ships, but a, uh, an anvil arrow, I guess. All right, so don't log out in space. That's bad. So I'm gonna file a claim for the Andromeda. Maybe that's. Did you have to file a claim, Carrie? Is that what happened to you? Yeah, but it only took a total of two minutes. Okay, I'm gonna pay the expedited fee. I have I have have fourteen thousand credits, I think. Oh wait, it's four minutes. Wait, wait, is it four minutes or twenty six minutes delivery time? Hello. Twenty six sounds a bit too long. It it's it, I've got both. I've got both. Four minutes if I pay up. Okay, I will I will I will pay up. Because I want to, and then. I'm going to go meet you there, and then we'll fly back to this station, and then we'll board the Constellation. It should be ready by then. How's okay. that sound? Is your ship... That sounds good, yeah. Can I hold two people? Your ship? Your other one? No, we're going to take your ship and my ship and fly it to Stanton. But we're going to okay. meet at... at um, my ship has, like, um, an entire, like, kind of garage, kind of. So maybe you could just hang in there while we fly. And we'll only need to use one ship that way. No, no, this is cool. Let, let, we'll meet up, and then we'll fly back. Can I fly the Merlin? Isn't that docked to my constellation? I'm not sure. I'm asking the... Anybody in the community know? Oh, thank you. Um, Zentoki says, Oh man, the likeness of your avatar is awesome looks just like your profile pic. That's because it's the same artist who did both. Really talented. And then someone from the community rigged it up. Dita. Dita4OK rigged up my avatar. Thank you so much for doing that. Uh, I'm just going to go with the, the anvil arrow. I don't know what that is, but that's the one I'm going to fly. Or, or, or attempt to fly. <laughs> Okay, Hangar 3. So I didn't know this, and I kept going to every hangar in the game trying to find my ships, but you have to go to this terminal to retrieve it, and it, it says I'm in Hangar 3. It said 3, right? I'm so excited, I don't even remember. Run. Alright. It's also visible on your HUD. Okay. 
calling it elevator. Then we got to go to hangar three. This was a process. I think I spent two hours just trying to figure out how to get to the spaceport between the crashing. Like I had one crash, not, not a crash. I got stuck in the tram, had to kill myself and then come back. I don't know why I have an anvil arrow. I don't recall ever buying this ship. Is this flyable? Can I get in? Maybe you have to enter from the back. Oh no, here we go. I love all the entrance examination. That's one thing I want to do for Ember is, especially when you're a heavy mech, we got to have an animation for when you get into the mech. Lone Wolf says my avatar looks high. It's the eyes, isn't it? I, I think I have to... You know, this is the first time we've done this, so I think we have to, to figure that out. All right. Um, and then hit R for the shortcut startup. Okay. We have systems online. Why does the inside of your ship look so much cooler than mine? It's all glowing stuff. Mine you have glow. one too. They're saying because they're having the Invictus event, everyone gets this ship to try. Oh, I have that ship too? Apparently, yeah. That's what they're saying. Huh. All right, so now we're gonna request clearance to leave. So I got to bring up my hand thing. And then I'm going to go ahead and hit comm link. This is so detailed. And then apparently the landing services is my friend. Just like just like Kiri. So I'm clear to launch and communication. And then if I look up see the doors opening that's pretty cool okay so um, I guess mouse wheel controls my throttle I didn't know that for the longest time and uh, let's see so should I go maximum thrust for takeoff that's how it works right Or should I just do a slow and steady takeoff? What's the community say? Full throttle? Slow? Split the difference. We'll go halfway. Okay, here we go. Space bar, I think, is the vertical takeoff. And we're up. And I think I've got to get some minimal air clearance here or something. That was almost as good as my first takeoff. Your first takeoff was upside down. No, no, no. It was <laughs> I saw it. Nope. <laughs> Thank All right. you. I got a tooltip that is encouraging me to shoot my weapons. But that would be a bad thing, wouldn't it? If I shoot up the spaceport. I heard there's a prison. Yeah, I don't even think you can shoot them right now. I think there's like an armistice zone or something. Do a barrel roll. Oh, 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 oh way too fast. End to raise. Thank you. End to raise the landing gear. It's a good idea. Landing gear raised. raised. All right, I'm throttling, throttling up, or I'm, I'm going forward. My throttle is up. And to get to space, I, I think I just pointed up last time, set my thrust to max, and pushed forward. I don't even know if this is the right way to get to space. Oh, Bakasura, you're right. That wasn't aileron roll. There was no rudder involved, so it's, it's not a... Isn't a barrel roll need a rudder? I don't even know what Uchu Senkan Yamato is. 
F, uh, F4 to see my ship in third person. How do I orbit the ship? Like, how do I swing my camera? Hold down shift? No, 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 that's bad! Oh, this, this isn't good. This isn't good. All right. Uh, why is it warning me that I'm leaving a restricted area? Isn't that a good thing? Shouldn't be leaving a restricted area be, be what you should do to be a good star citizen? Okay, I don't know why I'm flipping around. I'm certainly not doing this. Okay. Oh, my controls are... Uh, oh. Uh, there we go. Okay, 30 degrees, nose up. Oh, so you can be shot by other players when you leave the restricted area. That's why it's warning you. Thanks, Giga. All right, so we can take a look at the... Uh, I mean, it's seamless, right? The city's down there. Hopefully we are back, and you, the stream should be back. And we're relaunching Star Citizen, but I'm stuck on the loading screen. There we go. Does this mean I have to file a claim on my other ship? I think you do. Please, please no. No. <laughs> Did I lose my spaceship because I disconnected? My wi my Wi-Fi crashed? Just to be clear, Star Citizen didn't crash. My Wi-Fi went out for a moment. I think I need to get a new router today. And we said this last stream, that I need to get a cable modem with Wi-Fi 6. Make your ISP play the game and refund you an in-game currency. Oh no, Nizul, do I really have to file a claim for this ship? No! Laufer guy says I have to file a claim too. No! I'm using Wi Fi. I'm not hardwired, which I guess should be a lesson to me. This, this sucks. So if I lose connection, my ship's gone. It, it won't reload me into the ship where I was last left off. Uh, the software, uh, Azura Snack ask what software I'm using for this. This is uh, VTube. Got off Steam, 15 bucks. But the rig was done by Dita in Live, t I think it's called Live 2D or something like that. Uh, the game is... I don't know where I downloaded it. I don't, I don't know if it's on an SSD. Oh, shoot. I'm not in my ship. Okay, I gotta get up here. Hopefully the Andromeda's ready. I don't know how many credits I have left. But I'm quickly spending them on claimed insurance claims for ships. And and f and probably I'm gonna need fuel. Are you? Did you dock, Kiri? Did you get there? I did, yeah. And you're docked? Yep. I'm at the um, HUR L2, I think. Okay. Let's see. Uh, ground floor. There's no fast way to go. Kerbinot asks, will there be insurance claims and taxes in Ember? I don't know. 
What, do you think I make the game or something? So is there is there a fast way to get to the hangar or do I have to like I gotta travel there, don't I? At least I know my way around here a little better now. The tram is the fast way. Okay. I see my VTuber hasn't attracted any new viewers, probably because I'm not kawaii enough. That's okay, the faithful are here. Yeah, I do need that maid outfit. The maid outfit will bring all the boys to the yard. Oh, there's a big summer stream right now. So I'm streaming against something really super popular. Great, okay, I picked the perfect day to stream. Well, actually, we always stream on Thursdays. What am I talking about? Oh, if OT1 says I, if, I, if I turned right when I left the hab, I would have been at, at the plaza immediately. Okay. I know I should, I should have a hot tub. In fact, we should add that. I should get a hot tub, and we should, we should put it in my VTuber as part of my thing. It, it'll be like a... You know, it'll, I'll wear the hot tub. It'll be like a miniature hot tub. You know, it'll be like those drawings with the guy in suspenders and he's got a barrel instead of clothes around. But instead of a barrel, it'll be my VTuber in suspenders with a hot tub around my waist. And then, then my Twitch viewership will be up. All right, sorry, Kiri. This is taking me a while to get yeah. to you. I just take it in time to restock my fuel and everything. Oh, there you go, Sai. A kiddie pool hung by suspenders. Obviously, I'm not. I'm not seriously trying to be a VTuber here. I just thought it was really funny and kind of a lark, and and the community made my dreams become real. So thank you. <laughs> thank you, Dita. Yeah, I need to do some body painting, some navel painting to get more viewers. But, you know, what amazes me is that Star Citizen has, what, 3 million players or, or backers or something like that? And, you know, I think the strength of their streaming community is that it's not many, but there's a lot of people who stream. It's like... Uh, a bigger group of smaller numbers. Like I look at the YouTube information and while there's some viral videos like the prison break video and stuff like that, it's not the regular streamers. The regular streamers who give you all the ship info and everything else, they have very small viewerships and a low number of views, but there are a lot of them. And I think in aggregate, that creates kind of like a, a good marketing presence for Star Citizen on YouTube. Plus it's, it's a meme. Star Citizen is a meme in itself, right? Oh, Azura Snack, sorry. Yeah, Carpal Tunnel is a bitch. Oh wait, was that guy hopping? Doing the Kassok dance, the Russian dance? Winter says, don't worry, I'll be a meme 20 years from now too, okay? In the future, we will all be memes. Okay, let's see. I don't want to. Um, I don't want to. I don't want something bad to happen here. But this is Star Citizen, so that's kind of asking for a lot, isn't it? Just a little. Star Citizen is a sequence of accidents waiting to happen. But I'm actually uh, checking. I'm actually really happy with this game. Okay, I don't want to take the constellation out yet. I kind of wait. I want to wait 
Kiri for you to come to the spaceport for us to do it. So I'm going to bring out the Merlin. I thought you had to claim the um, Andromeda. Uh, yeah, but the claim is ready. But I don't want to fly it to oh, you. Okay. I'm going to fly the Merlin to you. Oh, no, there's no faster than light drive? Okay, no. Okay, can't do that. Like, yeah, Star Citizen is incredibly immersive. Okay, I need to cancel this. It doesn't... The Merlin does not have faster than light drive. So... Oh! I, I don't have to file a claim on the... Um, Oh, I do have to follow claim. Shoot. Okay, I guess we're taking the constellation out. Um, I can just fly to your port and then before you bring it out, and that will still be a surprise. Surprise for you? Okay, yeah, let's do that. Okay. So my ship is waiting in Hangar Four. You're, you're, so far, you have more flight time than I do. So hopefully, you'll reach here successfully. Versus. What, um, what station are you at, though? Uh, Arc Corp? I don't know what station this is. What station this is this? Because last time I played going to a planet, I got right outside of it, and I kind of just ended up w keying towards it for five minutes, and it didn't seem like I got any closer. Oh, to land on a planet, you mean? Yeah. Okay, this is where we rely on our Twitch viewership, and our and if you're not in our Discord server, join us on Discord. We are in Area 18. You need to fly to Area 18. Chip 7 says. I am watching chat in two places, both on Twitch and in Discord. If you haven't joined our Discord server yet, please follow the link that Faye just posted. Oh, there is a space station in orbit above each main city. For Area 18, it's by Genie Point. So why don't I meet you at by Genie Point, which is in orbit of this planet? I see Lyria and Walla. I double click on it. And I see Arc 1 and Arc L2. All right. Uh, you don't see, you don't see the the station called Bajini Point. Mm, no, I don't. Let me see if I can see it. Zoomed in on it. Maybe it only shows up as a waypoint when you get to the system, get to the planet. I mean, oh, Lao Four guy says you can't see quantum points of interest. You have to tell Art Corp before he can see the quantum point. So I guess you have to contact. Oh, okay. So I hail them, right? When I'm near them? When I'm finished quantum traveling to them? I have no idea. Yeah, no, hail them. Right. Okay, so uh, Chip7 says landing at Bajini Point will simplify spawning. You avoid the long train route. Okay, let, I'm going there then. Taking the constellation out. It's, it's my big ship. I know it's not a big ship in the game, but it's my big ship. <laughs> Four. Okay. Okay, this is it. This is the constellation. Alright, I'm like. going from traveling now to Arcport, 35 million kilometers away. I'm trying to figure out how to get on this thing. I believe there's an elevator. Aha! So, I realized something early on that a lot of uh, Ember backers and Ember fans are Star Citizen backers. And. Raise your hands, those of you who, who back this, this game.
Wow, dude. Yep, Lao poor guy. Geronidin, Tech Slip, Giga. Wow, a lot of you guys. Well, I guess it makes sense. It's sci fi crossover, right? Yeah, I, I, I don't think I was an original backer. I don't think I did the Kickstarter. I think I joined soon after. And then... And then I, uh... I didn't. <laughs> Alright. Starting the ship up. I'm really nervous about losing this ship. You shouldn't though, right? Because there was a starter pack that you bought. Or, uh, I guess it's got some amount of insurance on it. So, yeah. But, I mean, just the time, I guess. We're having to pay credits for that. All right, I'm going to request uh, quest takeoff here. I don't, even, I don't even know how much money I have. How do I check that? I'm worried about running out of fuel or whatever current balance. I have 7,300 universal credits. That's not a lot, huh? Oh, all ships are lifetime insured right now? Okay, cool. Alright, let's, uh, let's Wait, do this. You have 7,000 credits right now? I do. How? I have 19,000. Well, I, I had coming. more, and then I paid to speed up the reclamation oh. of the ship. Oh, I see. Okay. That's a lot of money. <laughs> and, uh, so, let's see. Quest. Okay, hailing the landing services. Okay. I'm clear to launch. It's a lot of money for us new players, at least, who only start out with that much. Yeah, and I don't know how to earn money yet in this game. <laughs> well, sorry. I have a, um, a bounty thing in my thing. Maybe we could do that instead and get some money. Yeah, they, they, they say that the Constellation can do bounties, I think. I think. Yeah, let me check it. Contracts manager, yeah, bounty hunter. Okay. Based on the assessment of your um, abilities, offer you a chance to earn a tracker training permit. Take off officers. Take off. Collision alert. What? Landing gear up. Somebody in chat is going off in the game about some kind of hacking report thing. I don't know what's going on. Thank you. Please see this again. All right, so I got to get going here. Uh, let's throttle up. Afterburners. Oh no, we're good. There's also a mercenary job. We can reclaim a mine site for twenty-two thousand credits. That's enough to to pay for our ship. Yeah. Crashing. It looks like we can just claim it immediately. We don't need to pay a fee or go through some train permit thing. I'm trying to get to space here. Did you reach um did you read our reach the system yet? Read this um one? I'm about a million kilometers away now. Press there. C for cruise control. Okay. Cruise control is on, but throttle seems to be a little low. Lift off, shouldn't we go max throttle? When I hit cruise control, it like slows me down. Oh, okay, no, it's speeding me up when I can see here. I can hit Z and free look around. That's pretty cool. And that. That's why people play this game, is 
look at the city below and just flying. Okay, I'm at Arkport now. Okay, I will attempt to land there. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and hail the uh, thingamabobber. I don't. I don't think I should toggle VTOL now. OT1. Right? Wouldn't that be bad if I hit K now? Um, I can't hail the planet. How do I? You can't hail the planet? No, I can only hail you. But we'll chat on my own ship and party. Alright, I'm gonna level out here. I'm gonna try to find the station. Did you find the station? Mm, yeah, I'm gonna look in the map. See if you can find it. I can't see it. I still only see the moon's star port. Okay, I'm going to lower my thing. throttle down here. Just park a little bit. And bring up the star map. Yeah, this game does have trade chat spam. Uh, Maybe we could just go to Arc L1 or Arc L2 meet up there. It's easier to dock at those places than mine, it looks like. Because I can't, like, find a way to dock the ship here. Okay, well... Yeah, I'm taking out the, the Discord chat thing. So, help us out, guys. You said there's a space station around here. How do we find it? How do we find the space station? fly forward okay okay so is it just a visual thing are you orbiting the planet uh kiri mm -hmm. yeah so just fly towards it so i'm looking at my hud there's an i uh, all right oh wait oh uh it's calibrating towards the planet even though i'm right here I don't feel like I'm the planet's like this planet feels big, like I don't think I'm getting anywhere. Oh I see area seventeen. Where's Oh I see area eighteen, that's where you're at, right? Yeah, on the planet. That's where I was. Yeah, but they want us to go to the space station now. Tap B to turn on the, the, the quantum drive to see the locations you can go. Okay. Oh, if you tap B, there's a bunch of markers on your map. Yeah, that's what I did. I can see everything now. Wait, are you outside of Arc, uh, arc Fork right now, whatever it's called? I see Arc, Microtech, Hub L2. CRUL. Trying to find the nearby space station. Arc L5. That wasn't it. Hey, what's this square icon? Ah, I found it. By Genie Point. 256, 59 kilometers. Yeah, got, I got the square, Winter. Thank you. Wow, for guy, thank you. Okay. So, yeah, uh, scroll around. When you're when you're over the surface of the planet and you've got your uh, your your nav points up... Mm -hmm. Look for a square. It look for a square icon. That's the genie point.
Okay, am I calibrated? I'm gonna hit B. I oh, know that that didn't do anything. Oh, I gotta I gotta hold B, right? Okay. B brings it up. Quantum drive online. 20%. 40, 50, 60. I guess this is the calibration. I guess when it gets to 100, I can. Okay, I tapped B and it turned it off. Oh, you gotta hold it. Okay, so calibrating again. If it weren't for Twitch and Discord, I could never play this game. And then hold down B. Okay, we are here. I'm here at the station. Okay, I just need to find the square. I'm going to attempt to. Oh, you can't find the square? No, I can't. Unless it's like, is it a diamond or a square? It's it's a square. I mean, it could look like a diamond if it's on its side, but... Okay, I'm going to... If I rotate my ship, it always did as a diamond. Okay, and I got to slow down. I'm trying to slow down. Why can't I slow down any more than this? Inertia. Okay. I'm going to contact the spaceport to land. So I see um, Larry and OM3. Can I just go off of that to find it? Uh, what are they saying in chat? How can Kiri find the station? Okay. What landing bay was I assigned? It says, please proceed to assigned landing bay. Where? I guess it's highlighted. Find out. Please be highlighted. Is it, is it that one off in the distance there? On the other side of the ring? Oh no, it's this circle chevron thing. Edging forward, throttle up. Is it a bay or a pad? I think I'm going to make it. Famous last words. too fast or you will crash. Okay, we're going real slow now. Too slow. It looks like it, I'm on the inside pad, so I gotta land here somehow. Not to go, go too fast. Oh, Kiri, you, we had a question the other day when we played. We're like, can we jump? Can we open the cockpit? Landing gear. Landing gear is oh. coming down. While quantum travel, right? Yeah, while quantum uh, traveling. Uh, I wanted to try, but I was too scared to. What happens when you open the cockpit during quantum travel? And you can jump out of the ship? I see another ship. You see me landing? Uh, is that the cyber police? I'm not what? the... I'm not the popo. They, they said halt and stop moving and now it says remain stationary as you are scanned. 
Oh, okay. I, you better halt then. Oh, Customs uh, inspection, maybe. I said I'm good to go now. Hold down N for auto land. Well, that sounds good. How about we manually land? Because I'm that kind of guy. Uh, how do I descend? Did you did you hail them for for landing? I can't hail them at all. Okay, we are gonna go. And I'm gonna try to man manually land this craft. We did it! We landed! We did it! Twitch Fly Star Citizen, thank you so much for your help. Wow, here we are. I'm on I'm on the station. Can I go outside or do I die because I don't have a spacesuit or something? You can go outside, I'm pretty sure. I couldn't have landed this 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 spacecraft without the help of Twitch. Wait, why are there lasers? Who's shooting? I hear I hear gunfire. That can't be good. Uh what? 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 What's happening? What's happening? I don't know if I should go outside. Oh, someone with a crime stat? Dragon Dios says someone with a crime stat's around the station, so security just killed him. Okay. Uh, I'm going to... Okay, so we are we are landed. Wow, that's not a bad landing. I mean, I'm 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 kind of centered on that pad. I'm kind of centered on the pad. I'm I'm proud of myself. And Twitch. Wow, check that out. First landing. No autopilot. The only time I lost the ship is when my Wi-Fi disconnected. Yeah, I am playing with someone else. I'm playing with Kiri, and we're trying to meet up at Bajini Station here. I'm, I yep. landed on Pad 7. I can't find the station, though. Oh, that's a problem. Yeah, I've been looking around, and I haven't found any squares. Uh, Alright, so I think... Well, let me let me lock up my ship. Can you can someone just jack my ship right now if I left this open? Wait. Did you find it? Is it called Virginia Point? Virginia Point, yeah. Oh, okay. So how do I close this elevator? Okay. So here's a tip, Kiri. Chat says if you leave your ramp down, they can jack your ship. So oh, lock, really? lock your uh, ship after you land. Okay. I see the station now. Make sure to lock it when I land. I mean, not the ship, the uh, station. Wow, I was blind. I couldn't find that thing for so long. I think part of it was because it said point instead of station, so I didn't really register it. Why is local chat going crazy? There's some sort of drama happening. Alright, 
So how do I set my spawn point in here? Where's the airlock pad? I assume this is an airlock and I've got a... Oh, here it is. Uh, did you find it? Yep, on the uh, bay I'm supposed to land at. I don't see your ship, so have ready. I'm on pad 07. Yeah, I was just worried I'd see it while I was trying to dock. Well, I'm going to go out and look for you. Um, I can't tell which one I'm at. I'm near like the center of the station, if that helps any. I... You know the two arms that hang off the rear of the ring? I'm parked in on the inside of one of those pads next to a, a Mercury, which is a ship that I've wanted. Gotcha. I landed, so I'm going to get off. Individual 11 in chat's going off on hackers. So, if someone hijacks your ship, can you not even like play my back through the terminal? I don't know. How do you get your ship back if someone jacks it? If you just don't, it's just stolen. I kind of want to try that now, but that'd be an asshole move. Yes, you can claim it at an ASOP terminal. Okay. Okay, you can file a claim. Alright, I didn't see you, so I'm just gonna go and. Uh, yeah. I'm on I'm pad on, 7. Pad 7. Can't forget that. I'm Don't on, lose my ship. <laughs> I'm on pad 3 right now, so I guess I'll head over to pad 7. Uh. Oh, yeah, we could do that. Yeah, I'm heading over to pad you, 7. I think. Do people wanna see the lobby, though? I mean, I wanna see the lobby. So I'll, I'll go to the lobby and then I'll go to pad 7. Okay, um, I'll just wait at pad 7. I won't look at the ship until you're here. Well, you can't get in it. You can walk around it. True. Uh, I just won't look at it at all. I'm just going to have it be a surprise. Okay. Yeah, we're doing a bunch of new things. We're testing out my new VTuber avatar and we're playing Star Citizen kind of sort of for the first time. The lobby. Okay. This is a Cyberpunk 2077 moment here. I think they share source code. I have a NPC that's stuck in a loop, walking forward over and over again. I'm not going to make fun of it, though, because I'll tell you a story. When making WoW, I used to make fun of how on EverQuest, the boats would always dump you in the ocean. And I said, how hard is it to make a boat? And then when we did it for WoW, we had the worst problems with people falling off boats. So I will never mock in-game bugs, because I, I know that the stuff is a lot harder than it looks. I guess that's it. I guess this is the lobby. It's 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 kind of small. It's just a room. Is there a big... I'm going to help but, uh, take a look at the pad, and there's no ship there. There's no ship on pad 7? There's no ship there. Yeah, I think it despawned or something. You'll have to call it back. Uh, okay, that might be true. Well, come Come to the lobby. Yeah, I'm coming to the lobby right now. We we are in a party, Dragon DS. I think. Are we? <laughs> oh, we might be on separate servers? Oh no. <laughs> uh oh. After all this time. So if we go back to menu and party up. Oh, do you think when I disconnected, it, it, yeah, I don't see you in the party anymore. Okay, yeah, then, um, let's try reconnecting, I guess. Well, I'm gonna, gonna I'm gonna guy. try just inviting you to party from here. See, oh, I can't. Alright, so I guess we exit to main, is it safe to exit to main menu if we've landed? Okay. They say we, they say we can go to menu. So exiting okay, the menu. Tomix1199, was that in general chat, that quote? 
That's a great quote. You put cheese on my burger. Why do you defend McDonald's? It's the best line I've heard so far. Yeah. That was funny. All right, I'm at menu. Are you at menu? I'm at menu. It says your party leader. We're in a party. What happened? I'm not I sure. I mean... All right, uh, let me try launching Persistent perfect. Universe, and it should suck you in. Okay. Giga says, so party up. We are partied up, yeah. And start the game, and the other right-clicks the name and selects Join Game. But I think what happens now is it actually sucks you in, right? Okay, why does it say Stanton System? Oh, because it's a system. Okay. Yeah, that's a system. And then just visit location. And it should bring me with you. Yep, I'm loading. And it, it just hit your loading screen automatically? Yep. There's an invasion winter? On a shard? Is it a Vandal invasion or something? Or whatever they're called? Oh, you're making a Firefall reference. Yeah, that's funny. Shard hopping for invasions. I remember that. It takes so long to load the game. They they say it takes a lot longer if you don't ins if you didn't install it on an SSD drive. Mm, okay, I think I did. I'm not sure. I think you did too. Are there AI enemies in this game? I know the the cops. I saw someone shoot the cops and get thrown in prison for it. I think there is because there's bounties and everything. So you have to be able to have AI to hunt and bounty and whatnot. Okay, Ghost Rider, SG Ghost Rider says there are mercenaries on ship and on foot. Mm, okay. Yeah, Whiskake, the VTuber is real. We weren't kidding. And this is just, this isn't even my final form. Okay, I, I would like to get up now. Where's my menu? Okay. Are you loaded in? I am. You still loading? Oh, okay. Yeah, I am. I'm loaded in now too. I can see your name, 29 meters away. That's I've good. Space and W seems to get me out of bed, so I'm good with that. Um, they say Y is the hot key to get out of bed. Just like getting out of your seat. Uh, hey, finally. Hey! <laughs> that only took like two hours. Uh, Alright, let's see your ship. Let's see the uh, Andromeda. Uh, are, we, are we both chicks? Is this what we're doing? I yep. see how it is. Okay. Like you father, like son. Now. Yeah. Okay, elevator fight. Let's do this. No thanks. Uh, body. I see a gun in your hip. I have a gun. As soon as, yeah, as soon as we get in the ship. Do you have a gun? Hi. Hi. <laughs> yeah. Let me know if there's anything I can help you with. Oh, this this NPC speaks. This is the first time I've heard an NPC say got something. Got new inventory. Definitely worth taking, taking a look. Okay. What, she's got a side hustle? What's going on? She's got inventory? She she manages the hat, hey, hey, right? Back again, I see. Well, welcome. But you can interact with her. I, 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 there's nothing I can do. Oh, okay. Oh, you're, now you're blocking me, so. That's <laughs> a new inventory. Definitely worth taking a look. Can I do head pats? Okay. Okay, I can't endorse this game. There's no head pats. I'm clicking on her head. Nothing's happening. Game without head pads is trash. Someone said, why is game sound doubled? Oh, it might be. It might be because of uh, voice meter, but I really can't change that right now. Or stuff might break. Bad things. All right, where do we go? So... We gotta find... So 
mind the step. Okay. Here we are. Security. I want to see what the guns look like on the ship. This is the main part I'm excited about. Can we get a mission if... Okay, I'm going to retrieve the... Can we get a mission while we're on the ship? I think so, yeah. I think we can get one now, actually. Let me check. So, contracts. Oh, yeah, there's a bit. There's delivery, search, maintenance, bounty hunting, and mercenary jobs. Well, I am way zoomed yeah, so in Yeah, so... If you open up the contract manager... I mean, um... What's it called again? Just press F1, whatever that is. I forgot what it is called. OB class. Uh, I don't know what's happening. Pad five. Okay. All right. I'm bringing up contract manager. This we can, one pays for are we are we doing 000. we're doing bounty hunter uh if you want to sure we can do the um one that pays for ten thousand this one pay only pays 500 i'm sure the fuel costs more than that <laughs> maybe we should be safe and do a delivery mission first well it's oh it's a certification we have to pay them 500 to apprehend a ranked criminal by the name of oh. Efren Ensley, last seen at the asteroid surrounding Yella. You want to do that? Uh, sure. Yella is far away, but you can do it. Uh, what's the other one? The other one is apprehended one suspect hijacker, high checker on um where where is he located though to successfully complete the certification process you must apprehend wanted suspect high checker oh that's pvp suspect apprehension and tracker training Okay, I don't think we're ready for PvP yet, but we can try. Yeah, I say we do delivery first. That doesn't sound too risky. And okay. Pays 10, <laughs> we're, we're chickening out. <laughs> we're like, <laughs> let's, let's just start. Being let's flying. just start with delivery. To practice flying. Okay, I'm gonna let you fly the ship this time. Oh, great. Um, okay. Because it, um, it it gives me agita. Okay, payment ten thousand. Um. Collect all packages from Shubin Mining Facility at Sal 2 on Lyria. Okay. Yep, I have the same one. That's actually near us, I think. That's a moon at um, our car. I, I accepted it. I accept. Right, I accept it too. And do I have to share it now? Mm, I accepted it too, so I think we should be okay. So if I go into my accepted tab. Wait, hold on. You gotta share to have the same quest. Oh, you do? Okay. I clicked share. Did anything come up for you to accept it? Uh, no, nothing did. Here, let me... Yeah, no, I don't, I don't see anything. Oh, left bracket to accept. I didn't... Oh, I see it now. Okay, you got it? There we go. Yeah, I got it. Okay, so we have to collect... <laughs> two package packages. Me, yeah. We're Uber now. <laughs> Right, this is a is oh wait important tip Lao for guy says this is a dangerous transport quest do not quantum you will explode okay that that oh. sounds like a long trip hmm I mean Lyria is right here though it's just a moon for this planet so I already forgot what pad we're on what did I say uh -huh. I forgot to pad seven thank you winter no, no pad yeah. seven was the original when I retrieved it what did it say Pad five. five. Look, Look around, around for your ship, ship pip. I think he's talking about the HUD. If you go into um, the vehicle loadout manager, is that it? 
I don't know. It's pad five. There it is. Yeah, it actually says on your HUD, pad five. All right, okay. here we go. What could possibly go wrong? Nothing. Nothing could go wrong. Yep. This is Star Citizen. Five, right? Yep. Hit it. Yeah, the least buggiest game on this planet. How do I shoot him in the back? <laughs> oh, you heard that. Oh, hey, hi. Uh-huh, hi. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, I'm just going to always face you. You're not going to shoot me in the back. <laughs> <laughs> it's a... Uh, this is a long elevator ride. I think the bump means we arrived. All right. How do you play your gun again? One key, I think. Number pad one. So we can't pull out guns. I, I, yeah, we can't. Oh my god. Okay, I'm turning my back and you look at this. What? Right. Let's let's walk around. Let's go to the right. This right is a side. starter ship. This is one of their their lower end ships. You this joking? Is, it's humongous. This is like one of the OG ships that they had. I think. Yeah, this is the Constellation Andromeda. They redesigned it. They gave it a new cockpit, I think. So it has a, a wider view. And this has uh, vertical takeoff capability. I call it the elevator. How do I? Why just it's. It's. Oh, okay. okay, bye. <laughs> where am I going? Wait, where are you? You're not even. <laughs> You're stuck in the ship. Your legs are dangling out of the hull. This is this is I've seen this in videos. <laughs> I've seen this. All right, uh, here, I'm gonna I'm gonna do the pad now. You have an entire lounge in your ship. Oh, the gunner seat looks so cool. Dude, get in the gunner seat. Yeah, I'm in the gunner seat. Is there an animation for it, or do I just teleport? Oh no, I get in. Okay, it's an animation. Oh, that's so cool. I feel like I'm in like um, Star Wars or something with that chair in the middle of the Falcon. That's kind of similar to that. Yeah, it is. It, it's totally like the Millennium Falcon's turret. Oh, wait, how do I move the turret? I cannot move it because you haven't taken off yet. Yeah, I, I don't think the ship is powered. There was an explosion nearby. Did they just blow up another criminal? I have no clue. Chip says you can press F12 if you want to hide the chat box, which helps a lot. Thank you. That got really annoying. How do I All get right. out of the gunner's seat? I can't move or do anything with it, so I might as well get out. I'll check for drama. Backwards. Some people like the drama in, in the chat, so I'll, I'll check every once in a while. But now okay. now we're all business around mission. Did you get out of the turret? Are you still in it? I don't are know you... how to get out of it. <laughs> Why? Why? Okay. Why? Oh, okay, not not way. why can't you get out of the turret, but why to exit the turret. Yeah, yeah, I don't hear you. <laughs> cool. Oh, no, no, don't go back. <laughs> I want to. Uh, All right, come back here. One? Like, uh, I don't even, I don't think this ship has a bed, which concerns me. No, it, it has. Here. It, it does? There's four beds here. Yeah, look. Oh, oh, awesome. Okay. So I guess... Uh, well, we'll come back here. This is the cargo bin. hold. Oh, this looks so cool. Wait, and why so am I dying? When we, when you died? I lost 9% of my HP. Did you fall? Wait, no. wait, your face tracker's on. Let me see, let me see your face. Terrible. It's really funky. So, try smiling. <laughs> uh, I think my VTuber has better expressions. Yeah, no, it definitely does. <laughs> Okay. Oh, wait. No, hold on. Oh, oh, they I say if you sprint, Mrs. Uh, no, Shane, Shaney is saying if you sprint and hit a wall, you'll hurt yourself. Oh, really? Wow. Why does this have to be... Oh, we got to get off the pad or we're going to be stowed. So let, let, we got, let's take off first or we're going to oh, be yeah, put back into storage and then I'll, then we can finish the tour of the ship. You, get, you can take off. I'm just going to explore the ship here. Oh, dude. Check out the back. There's a docked snub fighter. I don't want to see that. Hold on. They won't open it for me. Okay, uh, there's a little bit of lag. I want right, to get off the pad, so... Because they say that we'll be stowed away if we don't get off the pad. Chip 7 says that. Okay. Thank you, Chip 7. I'm not 
just gonna go back. I can't see the snub fighter, so. Uh, Alright, we'll come up here and grab a seat. Yep. You can request. Uh, is there a hot key for requesting. Co pilot seat? Take off or whatever? Are you sitting? Yeah, I have a monitor in front of me. Oh my god. Let's see. Are you sitting on the right or the left? The left side. Cool. What's on your monitor, though? What do you see? It's all black. <laughs> okay. I think... I don't know what that crew position does. Some of them are like... Um, all right, we got, we're going to spool the engines up here. This one said co-pilot. You don't need permission to take off landing pads. Oh, okay. Gear up. Okay, I want to fly by the station a little bit. Yeah, we are. Okay. You know, I don't think this co pilot seat does anything, so I'm just going to get out of it. Okay. Why to get out of it and see what happens? I'll go in the gunner's seat and see if I can move it now. Yeah, to me this might as well be a max level ship. I don't know how to start a ship. So you're like a a Uber Sea of Thieves player, right? Uh wait, what do you mean? Like you've put in a lot of time on Sea of Thieves and you've got like some legendary rank. Old R Shannon says. Um yeah, Sea of Thieves you can like carry cargo and everything and these different docks and places have like certain times when one item is more valuable than the other so you and can you definitely you can definitely draw a comparison between sea of thieves and and our star citizen mission here and we'll see what happens okay i'm trying what, to turn on the turret is... R, but exit guy mode fire mode power on there we go. Okay. Oh my god, that's so cool. Giga has one of the, I think, the biggest ship in Star Citizen right now. He has the Javelin. He says it's so long that it has a tram inside of it. Oh my god. What? Oh, that was you the shooting. Train, right? I was like, I'm getting ready for evasive maneuvers. I'm trying not to shoot the guards. L for like headlights. That. Okay, I've got my headlights on. Can I shoot our own ship? I can, like, shoot our own ship. I can see, like,. I want to try it. Can I try it? Sure, go ahead. I'll let you know if the shields take a hit. Nope. Alright. No? Alright. <laughs> Giga says it's the biggest ship you can actually own. I, I can't imagine. Can you actually see that in space? Can you, can you at least... I, it's not flight ready, right? But can you walk around it? The javelin, I mean. So it looks like there is a uh, top turret and a bomb turret. I actually got into the top turret. There is. is like. You want to practice the the snub fighter? Can you get back there and and get into the cockpit? Um. Yeah, I can. Considering that, as I try to get into the um. Lower we gonna see I got teleported into the cargo bay. Right. I wanna see this. Uh, I wonder what happens if I'm in the airlock while you take off. So I'm in the back now. There's like this window in the center. It looks like. Okay, I'm just gonna I activate um, well actually let's get our destination dialed in. Where are we going again? <laughs> Laria. <laughs> Laria, okay. Yeah, I don't see a snub fighter here. I mean like Unless I'm just blind, but... Okay, route's locked in. If I hit C for cruise control, will it orient me there? Diamond marker is your objective. Oh, I see it. Pick up package. 120,000 kilometers away. Okay. Oh, is it this door? Or is this the door to... Oh, that's an airlock. I probably shouldn't open that. Uh, the side airlock? Yeah, that'd be bad. Alright, I'm getting oh, out of the seat. Wait. Cruise control no, no, is no. active. I opened up the entire thing by accident. 
Uh, Dragon Dia says I'm doing it wrong. It's okay. We'll, we'll be okay, right? Like I can walk around for a bit and then, and then, uh, okay. So, uh, cruise control is not autopilot. Did you come back here to the rear of the ship yet? I went to the rear of the ship, but I didn't really see anything like a, like a new ship or anything. Like oh my gosh, where's this nut fighter? It's just a hole in space. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I was wondering, like, it looks like a galactic commode. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? I don't want to walk over that. I, I think I'll fall out if I walk over that. I, I thought it was a window. I walked over it and it didn't fall out, but I did kind of glitch. Yeah, I was so confused. I'm like, where's the snub fighter? I never took it out. Do I? <laughs> oh my gosh. What happened? I mean, there's just a hole. Where's my spaceship? Someone stole your snub. But it, this does look like this is where the bathroom is. This is <laughs> okay. All right, we're on a mission. We, we're getting distracted. We're on a mission. I was like, where's this snub you're talking about? I just see. I thought it was a window. But I was like, dude, check this out. It's the coolest thing. It's a big hole in my ship. <laughs> I'll get in the bomb chairs. Yeah, that looks like. You gonna try the turret? Yep. So you, oh, you're you able. Oh, it, it seals <laughs> you in. Okay. Yeah, I went through the floor of the ship. That didn't look very cinematic. You're in. <laughs> well, you know, it's it's an alpha. Oh, it got separated when it got stowed. Okay. So how do I reattach it? Do I have to manually dock it? Retrieve it and manually dock it? Oh. Okay, so we've got docking in our future, Kiri. Docking in our future? Okay. Okay. All right. Star map time. So star map. Uh, the route's already set. So I just got to... There's the waypoint. Yeah, I see it. Now, is that marker behind the planet, or am I going to the planet's surface? It should be a moon, so I think it's behind the planet. Okay, the marker's behind the planet, Shane says. So many Star Citizen backers here. I am so grateful for your help. I'm just going to go chill in the lounge. See ya. Okay. <laughs> Does the bathroom work? Is is there a pull out toilet? I know it's like a combo shower toilet thing. I saw it in a video, but I don't know if it actually you can actually pull it out. The smaller triangle is the waypoint of an intermediary orbital. Why do I need an intermediary? I can just can I just fly there? Oh, 120,000 kilometers. That's a good point. That's a long time. All right, so where do we go? Well, if I, I hate to say this, but is the is the ship smart if I if I lock onto that and then I quantum drive to it? Am I going to go through the planet? Maybe. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, holy moly. Uh, warping. What? The walls of the ship work for me. Okay, but it's dangerous cargo, you said, so I can't quick time back? I've got, I can't. Wow, that's too fast. Okay. Can I just like block your view? Right. Yeah, yeah, Easy. you're totally in my view. <laughs> Like, uh, need to land? Yeah, I Excuse me? Pilot, this is part of the co-pilot's trap right here. Yeah, to, to, to just 
be in the way. Okay, it says Lyria too close. Okay, that okay too close. We don't want a crater into the planet. Obstructed. Where's our mission waypoint? Paradise Cove. Shubin Processing Facility. What does our quest say? Can you pull it up, Kiri? Yeah, it's like you're actually a, a co-pilot. Uh -huh. I don't want um, quantum drive. We need to collect packages from Shubin Mining Facility, Sal 2. Sal 2? How do you spell that? Uh, S-A-L dash Oh, there it is. Pick up package. It is marked on the HUD. How nice of them. Nice. Um, I don't know if it matters, but the package numbers are 229384 and... Four five two seven two one. Reminds me of those package lockers. Okay, spooling complete. Am I locked? Can I? Can I quick time? Can I? Can I quantum travel to here? How can I tell if it's on or off? I think, do you want to sit down for this quantum travel, or am I just doing it? I'm just going to sit down, just in case. Yeah, I'm seated. It says it's calibrated energy. Yep, here we go. I get a monitor, but it doesn't show anything. It just blocks my view. Where am I going? Whoa! Okay. That's a roller coaster. I have a power on button. Okay, quantum drives offline. So I can control the heat, power, and comms. Okay. Can you turn on the AC? It's a little stuffy. Uh, yeah. Let me, let me check. Let me get back in the seat. Oh yeah, Sun Templar says this game is VR friendly. I have no idea if this game is VR friendly. VR is not in the plans. Okay. So you know. You mentioned something, Kiri. You said that this was a lot easier to fly than you imagined because you're not like a, a flight simulator aficionado. Uh, yeah, no, I was able to get the hang of it within 30 minutes or something. I have to say that I'm having an easier time with quantum jumping here than I was in Elite Dangerous. In the Elite Dangerous tutorial, I kept overshooting. Well, I don't know. They're saying it's a dangerous package, so we we can't quantum travel. File for guy. Did you explode? Do you ex yeah? Do you explode? What happens? Lau says yes. Well, the frame rate's never going to allow you to do VR for this very well. I think VR, you need 120 FPS. This thing is doing 30 right now. Well, it's doing more because we're not in a city, but... By the way, how much fuel do we have? No idea. Okay. Can you check on that status in one of the displays? Uh, I only see a power on button, so I guess I'll try to turn that on for the co-pilot seat. All right. Just get back in it. Uh, there's a monitor again. Power on. Lyle says we have fuel 99 and it's actually on my HUD. Okay. And I don't know where on my. Okay, it's, uh, I see it. Quantum fuel 99. I don't know what hydrogen is. I have 98 HYD. I assume it means hydrogen. Some rocket thruster fuel. And, uh... I guess it 
this is a 5k membership because you got 3 seats for the driving and then you got 2 gunners. Okay, hydrogen is impulse fuel. Thank you for the Star Trek translation. I understood that. Power. Uh, I guess I got a request landing, so F11 for comms. Platinum Bay Landing Services. Oh, I don't? It's an outpost? Okay. No, uh, escape is not the key. So should I land on the big pad or the, the smaller pad? I think I'm going to land on the big pad because the package marker is right there. You see it? Oh, I see it. Yeah, the monitor's blocked if I can see the marker. You can land anywhere, they say. Is this planet procedurally generated or is it always the same? I think it's always the same. Yep, gonna need landing gear. Thank you, Giga. Do uh, you want me to like put power to anything? Put, to do what? To put power to anything. You can you can divert power to stuff? Yeah, like I can overclock them. Probably don't need it here, but it'd be cool to I wouldn't be overclocking anything right now. <laughs> Let's land. Oh, we did it again. Look at that. I'd be pro. I'm pro now. I'm on like one day already. Let's go get this package. Second perfect landing. It would have been bad if Giga hadn't reminded me about the landing gear, though. You know what? Uh, that's a good point. I'm not going to use the elevator because we're getting um, we're getting cargo, so we got to figure out how the cargo bay doors work. Um, Shaniel says to turn off the engines or your ship may fly away. Well, that would be bad. That would be bad. Oh, I can open the cargo bay from where I am. Okay. Go ahead. Or no, uh, yeah, I'm on board. You can pick up the package, I guess. Oh, wait, I guess no, I'm, I'm coming with you. I want to see this place. Should we just keep it closed until we get the cargo gear so no one? Yeah. Can yeah, let's close this time. Yeah, let's not get our ship jacked. That would be bad. All right, how do I turn off my engines? Uh, it should just be R, right? If you hold R. Nope. Okay, I'm gonna go pick up the package while you do that. Okay, switch in the top left. I guess that's like cycling the air. Power right off. That's gotta be it, right? There's a dude here. <clears throat> oh, Dragon Dio says I is for engine, F is, uh, and U is for power, but I just powered everything down. I have one package, it does look very dangerous. The ship is very dark. It looks dangerous? Yeah. What, is, um, what does that mean? It has like a hazard display sign on it. Uh, Alright, I'm coming. It's really cool how you enter here though, because you gotta, it's like, an, it's an airlock and you have to cycle the air through a touch screen. So, do you see the package I have right now in my hands? Coming towards uh, me? you're, you're way distant right now. Oh, I see. Yeah, I'll get the other one. This is cool. <laughs> <laughs> There's no game. You can just you can really just role play in this pretty easily. If there was if this were Sea of Thieves, we'd be fighting Skellies right now. Or other players, yeah. Because other players can steer um, cargo and just sell it to the merchant instead of you. You know, I'm pretty so sure they can down. here too. So be careful. <laughs> I don't know, how do I drop the package without like blowing it up or something? I don't know, I'm trying to find the pad here. Oh, cycle, there it is.
I is for the engines, U is for power. It's only quantum sensitive. Oh, okay. Um, what's the button to put down though? I don't want to carry this thing forever. Just pressing the button right now. Hold that one good. It's an actual package oh. on the actual shelf. I wonder if each of these is unique. Like, if you get another mission, if you get another package. Oh, yeah. I kind of wish we had a bigger package, you know? Like, we have this really tiny cylinder for our giant bay. Like, honestly, the cargo, um, the cargo bay is bigger than my entire ship, which makes me kind of sad, but. We should try to fly your ship into the cargo bay. Uh, nah, the wings would get in the way would clip. It's not like you haven't clipped them before. <laughs> okay, how do you put down the package? Um, Lao said to look at it and, while holding F and click on it. So like, to interact with it like you would anything, you just drop it. And uh, I guess so. Oh, yeah, bring us up. I love the floor. I love these. It whatever these hard. things are. Oh, was that it? I think that was it, yeah. Oh no, they're coming to the floor. I'm picking that up. Uh, oh, oh no, 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 no. That looks like a, that looks like it'll explode. Okay, I picked it back up again just in case. I'll just drop it here. Yeah, it was only two packages. Do we just leave it here? Is there storage or? I mean, this is the cargo bay. Uh, yeah, but it's not, I mean, it doesn't look very secure, does it? <laughs> For dangerous cargo? Okay, they, they, they're saying leave it in the cargo bay. All right, uh, just don't fast shovel, I guess, so we don't die. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Oops. Was I going the wrong way? Is I that the see. aft of the ship? I can't see either. Oh, here we go. It's all blue. Okay. Here, yeah, because I, I, I shut down all the power. I should have just shut down engines, which was what key again? Oh, um, already. Here, I'm, I'll get in the co-pilot scene. Turn on the power. I. All right. I can just I for the engines. Do it. Actually, you should fly this one. No, oh, it's uh, the lag on the sit. I'm officially a VTuber now. I forgot. Big VTuber reveal. Did you turn on the power, or can you? I'm trying to. I click power on, but then it's that on. Sit, sit in this. Does, I don't know if the chair matters, but sit in this seat. Okay, I'll try. It won't let me get out, even though I'm pressing Y and holding it. A little bit of lag. Yeah. Okay, Giga says the chair matters. Uh, Shaney says co-pilot, etc. They don't function yet. Okay. Take us out. Uh, it won't let me get in the chair, even though I clicked on it. Uh, it, it won't let you get in the chair? No. <laughs> oh, there we go. It's just a lag. <laughs> yeah, the, the lag's pretty bad. It took. Oh, dude! The, the chair swiveled and then you snapped around to it. Oh, yikes. All right, what do I? Where's the power button here? Open exterior. That doesn't sound right. Oh yeah, I can press R. Wait, what? Why am I getting out of the chair? I don't know. Hi. <laughs> Giga, what does 30k mean? The, he says the server is about it. That server is about the 30k. It feels like. Oh, 30k means server crash. Okay. Well, let's do the whole startup sequence. Um, instead of doing R for the quick start, what's the, what's the startup sequence, guys, that we, we need to do this in? Dragon Dia says, Grums, I sent you a friend invite. If you accept, I can meet up with you guys. Sure, okay. Oh, that'd be cool. All right, so uh, F2 for social? No, F1? F11, F11, F11. 
Okay, Giga says press U then I. Oh, that worked. Okay. Okay, I guess I'll just take off then. Yep. Ready when you are, Cap. Whoa, to me it just looked like we popped to the surface. So maybe that's yeah. why they say a server crash is inbound. We better we better get to our destination before the server crashes and we have okay. to file a claim again. <laughs> and I have like six thousand credits left. It's like enough for one to expedite one claim. Where do we go? Is it that diamond marker? Uh I think you can just get us to orbit with C for cruise control. Yeah, uh, don't do not quantum actually, travel. Yeah, don't quantum travel. We can go full thrust though. Oh yeah, I'll just continue rising for now. Dude, your helmet's cool. It is? I yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot of detail. I thought having a VTuber avatar would make me instantly popular. I, 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 I'm disappointed. I've had no marriage proposals, no, um, no simping. Yeah, no simps yet. Yep. I thought it would be instant. You know, as soon as you have a VTuber avatar, you get simps. But it has just because you're a guy avatar. That's why. We're gonna yeah. we're gonna fix that though. Next update. <laughs> and I'm and I'm getting a virtual hot tub too. <laughs> I have no clue what I'm doing, so I'm just gonna fly towards the diamond. Yeah, that sounds that sounds legit. That sounds Oh, you know, I thought your hands moved when you used the joystick. I thought it would be that level of detail because this is Star Citizen, but I don't see your hands moving the throttle. I'm kinda surprised. I thought for sure, being Star Citizen, that we'd see the hands move. Yeah, let's let's hit F4 and hit Z to look around. Everyone wants to see the external view. Oh my God! Wait, I don't what, know what, what I'm doing? Where, <laughs> you're going down! <laughs> mayday! Mayday! Uh, hey, uh, our landing gear is down. You might want to retract. Yeah, I'm retracting that. Why okay. are we spinning? I'm not looking that way. I don't know. I'm I'm moving the camera around. Is that affecting you? Uh. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna hit F. No, I hit F5. I'm gonna hit F4 again. I think we're good now. Okay. I went back. Is that? I was in external view. Was that throwing you off? I don't think so. I shouldn't have. Uh, Sun Templar, if your ship explodes, it's dead. You have to claim it, uh, file an insurance claim to get it back. And you got to wait like 20 minutes. But if you pay 6,000 credits or something, it becomes four minutes instead or two minutes. I imagine that when the real game launches, ship claiming is going to be very a big money sink. <laughs> Imagine if Ember, every time you had to have, like, a claim, because you die so much in a shooter, and your mech blows up, that would get really costly. Whoa! Oh, well, it has inertia, too, so I can't just immediately stop it. I guess so there's another game, or a stream, Summer Game Fest. What's Elden Ring? People are talking about it on Twitch now. What have we all missed while we've been in here? Anybody come to the channel just now that... So, I, I was just looking at that myself. Uh, Elden Ring, of course, is the collaboration between R.R. Um, Martin, the Game of Thrones guy, and the makers of the Dark Souls games. Oh, wow. Did they do a reveal? They, they just revealed gameplay today, and I put a post there in the main lobby for the video. Well, how's it look? Uh, it looks, looks like a fancier Dark Souls, so pretty good. <laughs> I'm watching the trailer now. There's a concerning message in the chat saying make sure your boxes haven't fallen out of the ship. Oh. Okay, I'll go check on that. <laughs> okay, they seem to be there. Okay. The 
diamond and the thing disappeared, so I have no clue where I'm going to now. Yep, they're there. Okay, I'm gonna check the map. Where do we deliver these packages to again? Uh, let me check the log here. Contracts manager. The lag is real. Okay. Deliver to package. Go. Oh, we have two places to go. Uh, we're going to Lyria, Loveridge Mineral Reserve, or Humboldt Mines, both on this planet. Lyria. Oh, then this is the same planet. Yeah. Wait. Oh, I see it now. Yeah, on the bottom. Okay. Okay. So you want to take us to one of those locations? Yeah, I'm taking us to the one right in front of us right now. Diamond on the planet's surface. Yeah. I feel like I should have seat belts on, but I'm just running around the ship. The view's pretty cool. That view is pretty cool. Oh wow, Elden Ring does look totally like Dark Souls, just with better graphics and a, a little bit more color. Oh, I should increase the throttle. Yeah, that's making it go so much faster. Okay. How is this going to be a, a tie-in? I mean... Without all the gore, violence, sex, and violence of King of uh, Game of Thrones, how is this? How is this going to feel like a J.R. Mar G.R. Martin game? Uh, watch speed and altitude. They say, "Woo hoo!" Oh no! I think you're gonna I crash. Think, uh, you I have inertia. Pull up! 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 Pull up. <laughs> oh. This all this always happens when you pilot. <laughs> <laughs> in Sea of Thieves, I'm always like, Captain, there's a rock. <laughs> Captain, there's a rock. <laughs> My ship is so much to the control, there's like no inertia, so I was really confused with that. Oh my gosh, are we in trouble for losing the cargo now? Oh yeah, are we? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I sure did. Maybe I should I'm sitting here talking about Elden Ring. I'm not even noticing you're flying straight into the ground. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you should just pilot. I'll be the gunner. <laughs> that, that was funny. All right, let's see. But you know what? I'm kind of digging this game. I don't know what to tell you. Even though we haven't done anything yet, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's just, it's really immersive, isn't it? The lag is pretty bad. Elevators. Maybe the server oh, is about. Elevators. Yeah, maybe the server is about to die. Do not let the co-pilot fly. I'm gonna call it an elevator. Um. Yeah. So what happens now? Shaney says, "Quote: I haven't done anything. Why am I having fun? <laughs> is that what you said? <laughs> okay. Let's go file an insurance claim." <laughs> Can you give me money? I think I need like a thousand credits more to expedite the claim. I'm back. My audio cut out so I can't hear anything. Oh, I was like, do you have a thousand credits? Because I think I need a thousand. Oh, well, let's see how much the, the claim acceleration is. I don't want to wait 20 okay. minutes to get the ship back. Do you still have the quest? Oh, let's check. Oh, yeah. Just this, just this is a failure on there or something. Nope. No contracts. Available. Oh, I guess we failed. Okay. We have failed. Uh, uh chip it. seven. I am Wild Spark. Mind the step. Did you pick it? Did you pick a floor? Did I? Yeah. I was. I wasn't paying attention because I was busy plugging in my headset so the audio could come back. Oh yeah, yeah. I was waiting for you to push the button. There we go. Hi. Hi. Thanks, Thanks for coming, coming in. in. Bye. Check your contract history. See if you got a penalty for it. Uh. Oh yeah, there's a penalty for it, all right. What's a, what's the penalty? What do we do? We have to, is it like penalty. a fine? It just says you failed it. There's an X over the delivery package part. We gotta OT check more package, 
OT1 says check out the promenade of this station. Do we have to take the elevator for that? Yeah, it's spelled like that. If the cast matter, I think the W is capitalized. Yeah, the W is capitalized. Alright, come into this, uh... Yeah, I'm trying to. I called the elevator twice now, it's not coming. There we go. Galleria is where we're coming. I don't... I don't think... Wait, why are we going to here again? They want us to check out the Galleria. Oh, okay. <clears throat> yes, Chip 7, Wild Spark, just like that. This guy is um, standing on his seat, I don't think. They do that. I've been told that they do that. I stand with them. I can't even jump on top of them. I think, what is Platinum Assembly? Is it like a store? Hey, hey. Hey. Oh. Thanks, instigator. Law in... Law lit... What? what? Lawligator Esquire. Thank you. I'm not a real VTuber, I'm a game developer in disguise. Okay, I can't I can't choose any of that. Hey, hey welcome, welcome to, to <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna go up the stairs. I'm not gonna buy anything from here. It's also expensive. The terminal didn't work for me. Administration. Is there a place where we can see out into space? I think there is. In the um, long area, probably. This bar has music. There's a guy standing on top of the uh, bar. Now I feel like I'm in Cyberpunk 2077. Wait, what? Someone sent 50k to us? What? How do I check that? Holy moly! Who sent me that? Now we can go claim our ship. Thank you. <laughs> we made we made more doing crashing our ship than delivering the package. <laughs> we we do have simps. The VTuber avatar is working. Thank you, simp. <laughs> <laughs> See, it, it works! Having a VTuber avatar totally works! <laughs> yeah, I'm, gonna go to the, um, the I'm doing the hot tub next. Dito, we gotta do a hot tub. <laughs> the food court. You gonna buy a hot dog? Pizza? Nope. Do we have a pizza hut? Uh, it's dark here, man. I don't know. Whoa, what is this ship? Is that like a racer? It looks like that yeah, looks like cool. One of the ships. This is a really cool place. Look at the um all the holograms and stuff too, right? Noodle house. I mean this is this is pretty cool. But I want um I don't know why I want a space view. We were just out there. We don't need to do that. Let's go claim our ship. Let's at least start the timer for claiming. I'll, I'll go start the timer for claiming the ship. Okay, I'm lost. So I'll be there eventually. Okay, I'm I'm in the food court. I found the pizza place. Yeah, I found it too, but I'm not going there because there's not Pizza Hut. This stream only endorses Pizza Hut as the official pizza of champions. Yep. Hey, hey. 
Hey. With pineapple on pizza. Oh, no, 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 no. You're not invited. <laughs> no pineapple on, on pizza. By the way, I don't have to pay you back for the ship, right? <laughs> it's coming out of your allowance. <laughs> Stairs. I don't want stairs. I want an elevator, and I want, I want out. I, I want out. Where's out? I'm gonna go back the way I came. Oh, well, there's a Land Rover, Umbral Cyclone. That is a cool looking car. A rover. Yeah, I think that they were saying that that will fit in the dock. Yeah, yeah, just check, check it out here. It's in the uh, sign here. Alright. And it looks like it has some storage too in the back. It cycles in between, like, different views of it. Do you guys know if the cyclone fits in the Andromeda Bay? Cyclone fits, they say. That's pretty cool. If we can even afford it. <laughs> <laughs> we have 50,000 credits. If we if we get enough stream simps, uh, how much is this thing? Like, I wonder in-game credits. <laughs> we're, we're doing Star Citizen simping, everyone. Just <laughs> join in. It's cheap in-game, and Ursa will fit too. 35k. We have 35k. Thanks to... Who, who do I thank for that, by the way? Who sent that to me? Thank you for doing that. Dragon Dios. Thank you, Dragon Dios. Dragon Dios. Thank you for the 50,000 credits. I have no clue where the elevators are. Uh... I don't know, we were just using them. I think it's across here. Rest? Yeah, they're over here. Where I am. Where you are? Yeah. Look. I'm in you're, right now. You're in the food court. Oh, oh wait. Did you just warp <laughs> over there? What's going on? Oh, really, Chip7? Multi-trillionaires. Uh, okay. We have not even begun to simp, apparently. Nope. Yeah, next week, made avatar. Our goal is double the number of credits. <laughs> uh, this is the way Twitch works. Oh, according to the wiki, the cyclone's 28,000. I don't know if you can buy it in here, though. You want? I found hot dogs. Yeah, I see the hot dogs. Better than they look. That's funny. Okay, I'm gonna go to the terminal and I'm gonna start the clean process in our ship because I found the terminal finally. Oh, you teleported for me too. Yeah, this this server is not happy. Paying the expedited fee, and we still have money for a cyclone. All right, does anybody know we can buy a cyclone on this station? You can buy the cyclone at the New Deal inside Tessa Spaceport. Lorville Hurston. Okay, so if we find our way there, we'll, we'll do it. But okay. I think we've got a couple minutes on this claim. I expedited it. Thanks to Dragon Dios' generosity. Oh, I guess this is the viewport. Oh, it's dark. Someone turn the lights on. Yeah, no, I only have, um... I guess Avenger time. I don't have the new ship that you got. 
the the the, uh, the the constellation you were you crashed? No, no, no. The um the sh the ship that you said you got. Oh yeah, I don't know where that came from. They said it's for Invictus, but. Uh, Dragon Dia says, I just arrived at Vigini. By Johnny, can I get a party invite, please? Okay. Uh, F11. Uh, RC5. Who's RC5? Is it a random or someone on stream? Am I invite accepting RC5's friend invite? It's me. Okay. Better be you. On the couch. All right, Dragon Dios. Here is your party invite. And RC5, here's your party invite. Watch, well, Dragon's gonna have like a, um, a fleet destroyer or something from Star Wars. I don't know, but you're not allowed to fly it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll just have to be in the gunner, thanks. <laughs> third, uh, I ships. had two perfect landings on this stream, and you jinxed us with the third one. <laughs> I, can, I can land smaller ships, just not big ones. You're telling me it's like you're like, hey, I got really good at flying last night. <laughs> I'm like, oh, good, take the helm and <laughs> crash. Okay, now I'm stuck. Do I have to kill yeah, myself? I might oh, have. To. Oh no! Oh no! No no! Are we both stuck? No no, I jumped out. Oh oh, come on. Oh. Uh, what am I doing? I'm floating. I'm floating. Yeah, floating. Oh no, I might have to kill myself here. Flying, yes, landing, you no. Know. Just respawn when there's anything. Okay, so this is where I hold down, I think, the backspace key and kill myself. Yeah. Yeah. How do you do that? In your head. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm dead. It's tar citizen suicide is always the answer. Suicide is painless, it brings on many changes. Who knows where that's from? Mash. Theme that, song. That's right, Ronan Mash. I I didn't know the words for the longest time, but every time that song would come on, it made me feel depressed. And then I find out what the words are. I'm like, dear God, that explains it. This It's now the Star Citizen theme for whenever I get stuck. Seems about right. <laughs> um, I have nothing on my HUD. How, so, where's party chat? How do I get to party chat? So, Ronan, we were talking about uh, press tab. I did press tab. Oh, I see. Yes, Shaney, I know PSO2 New Genesis release. Toshi told me, and he had screen captured my avatar and said, now you can be everything you want it to be. And I've actually downloaded it. And I was going to stream that today, but instead... Uh, Kiri and I wanted to try Star Citizen. Now, Ronan, we were talking earlier about Star Citizen. You've always been curious about it, but you've never jumped in. Has this stream made you more or less inclined to try it? Um, so <laughs> I would say that this stream is, is relatively normal for the kind of other people's first jump into it. <laughs> so, so I wouldn't say it pushed me for or against it any. I feel pretty much the same, that it looks amazing. Amazing, but it's probably not for me. You could be simping in the hot tub with Kiri and I right now. And not simping, you could be you, a simpy. I, I, you know, maybe I should get myself a little lion uh, VTuber. I don't know, but <laughs> I, I, I can't, I can't, 
it, it looks remarkable, like, and it's truly immersive. But for me, it's like, um, <laughs> it looks boring. <laughs> I'd be so bored. I'm wow. like, I want to. I want to fight. I want to do things. I, I, like for me, you know, um, the the minutia of moving through all the little parts on the ship that I think are truly, you know, worthy of of making, and it's it's truly a fascinating sim. Uh, the potential for that is remarkable. But I I just the whole time be going like, oh my god, I don't care. Wait, I think I got some kind of invite. It said left bracket to accept something. <laughs> what do I have to do? All right. Okay, let's go see if the ship's ready. Or let's go see someone's ship. What are we doing? What's the plan? Are we looking at your guys' ships? I'm back. Yep. Welcome back, Kiri. Thank you. Got my air head here. What are we doing? I just asked party chat. Trying to find notifications. What am I an active member of? It says 48 of 57 in global chat. Is that just the chat channel? Uh, super massive bear. Is that who I think it is? Is this Giga Bear? Okay, I'll, I'll risk it. I can always defriend later. Okay, Giga says it's him. Well, we were trying to add a frown to my avatar, and I think it just defaults to me looking sad all the time. So, But this is our debut stream, so we can work out the bugs. So I guess we're going to, uh, you know, Dita kindly made this rig for us, uh, for my friend's artwork. And we're going to tune it from here. Oh, Giga, the server is full. It says 45 out of 55. Wait a second. How many players fit on one shard in Star Citizen? Yes, Whisper. My imagination is quite powerful if your imaginary simps have been made real. And we have imaginary simp money, too. 50,000 credits. <laughs> Fifty per shard? I thought this was massively multiplayer. It's only fifty per shard, really? Kind of random, but I have a guy with cat ears in front of me. Is that someone for stream? Uh, I don't know. I've, I've got my my thing up. Where are you? Yeah, yeah that's it, dude. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I want cat ears too. All right, uh, Dragon Dios has a Carrick, an MSR, a C2. I want to see the C2, because I really wanted a C2. But I can't justify it, because the, the fuel cost. Like, I couldn't do a mission that would pay for it. Yeah, we do have an audio loop. I can't I'm hanging by the hot dog terminal right now. Wait, where are we meeting? The uh, hot dog terminal near the um thing where you request ships. Oh wait, so how do we get to the are we gonna go to the lobby and then the gallery again? I guess. It's, it's just like in real life. Hey, there you are. 
How do I get name tags? I will give you that's F, I guess. No. Uh, Mage Rion says someone take Mark to a mission where they have to take back a captured ship. Those ships are nice. Okay, but I want to see the C2 first. Wait, do you get to keep those ships, or do you have to get them back to the, the owner? No, I think you, um... Oh, yeah, I don't want in-game audio turned on, so let me disable that for voice. Is it speech volume? How do I turn off in-game voice? I bought a hot dog. How do I eat it? You actually bought a hot dog? Oh. Yeah. I have a hot it's dog in on, my hands right now. It's on the chat hut. Okay, hang on. You really did get a hot dog. Yeah, let me eat it right now. It's my helmet. <laughs> Can you oh. eat the hot dog oh. through your helmet? No. Okay. Okay. Uh, How do I turn off this? Okay, going to hangar. Hangar four. Yep. Oh, okay. Remove the helmet and press or hold left mouse button to eat. SG Ghost Rider says. Hold the button to eat. <laughs> All right, now how do I turn off proximity voice chat or party voice chat? I have no clue. <laughs> you don't, don't want to hear, hear me anymore. anymore? So sad. Yeah. <laughs> no, they're, they're complaining that it's an audio loop because you're you're on Discord and you're in oh here. My God. What the? Where are the textures? I just see like inside just... of the ship. You don't see the textures yet? No, it's all. Oh, here, it's all in now. Oh, yeah, I just see a bunch of wires and stuff. Looks like a naked ship. Oh, my FPS is dropping. <laughs> oh, this, this feels oh. big. I gotta, like, scroll up to run faster. That's a bit big. Oh, oh the turret looks really cool, though. When looking at global chat, where the notifications were at the top middle, there was a toggle chat for audio. Okay. There we go. Dragon Dios, try saying something. It's still there. Uh, can you turn off your audio chat? F11, top of the screen. This is huge. This is ridiculous. <laughs> I'm gonna go up the ramp. Like five, six buggies in here. I I was looking at the brochure. They fit tanks in here. What? There's tanks. There's a ladder here too. Yeah, there there's the Nova tank. I don't know why they call them tanks though on stream. What the? There's just like elevators everywhere. What is this? It's up here. More cargo. Uh oh, this this. Okay, graphical glitch here. That's so cool. Whoa. Those doors are so cool. Oh, now the textures have loaded. Now I can actually see. Oh, no, now they're gone. And now and they're you back. You have like these side compartments where you have like beds for everyone and 
computers and whatnot. Here? Yeah, in the ship. I hit open and I'm waiting. Ship is so big that my FPS is just dying. I'm playing the slideshow right now. Whoa. I don't have these terminals now. I, I'm not, I am not touching a single chair on the ship. So Are you at the bridge? Platform. Yeah, I'm at the bridge right now with um, Dragon. I'm not touching anything though. <laughs> How do I get the elevator back? There should be a ladder in this dude, someone says you're in the cargo bay. Oh, there is, yeah. Yeah, I'll take the ladder back. Upper... Wait, I didn't climb the ladder? Wait, what's going on? Oh gosh, I get to you. Yeah, they have sensors. Yeah, yeah I don't even need to go on them. Whoa. Yeah, you see another beat here that we were talking about, like right behind you. Open that up. Let's go right here. Oh. Really cool side there's a. Here. There's like a rec room. That's kind of very Star yeah. Wars vibe right there. And then the other side has like this um, work. Glowy things. I'm sure that's safe. That looks very safe. Oh, and here's the crew quarters. I heard the C2 only requires a crew of two, so there's two bunks. Mm-hmm. They have a. a they have other variants that. Um, I guess the A2, which isn't available yet, is a military variant, and I think it has eight or something, plus room for troops and stuff. Wait, there's no way the shower actually works, right? I don't know. That's it. I don't think it does. Wait. I'm so confused. <laughs> oh, there's two of them, too. Dragon Diaz says A2 is the bomber, M2 is the dropship. Yeah, that's. Gotcha. But I was I was looking on YouTube and they were saying that um, right now in game it's kind of hard to make a profit flying this thing because to fill it up you need you need like millions of dollars of cargo. Uh. And to pay for its fuel costs. Very cool. Uh, you have you Dragon Dios. You have the Carrick too, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, that's like everyone says. That's like the Firefly Serenity ship. Can we take a look at that one? Oh wait, I want to see the bridge first. Let's let's go to the bridge. Oh yeah, the bridge is really cool. Where's the bridge? I just want to check out the bridge and thanks for showing us your C2. This is such a nice looking ship. Big ship. All right, let's take a look at the, the famous Carrick. How do we get out of here? No clue. I'm always living in here, though. I'll stay here. It's, there's got to be another way besides the cargo hatch.
26 million credits for a Astro Armada. Some dragon dog, I should probably take notes. Wait, did you, were you able to get out? No, no, I'm still in the cockpit. I'm just watching him and thing. Because he's going to stow the ship. Do you get stowed with it? I'm just gonna go out this way, why not? Uh, okay, not yeah, opening for me. Ship kind of teleported. I can't get out. How'd you get out? I didn't even get out. I'm still in the uh, cockpit. Well, I got him in the main deck now. Yeah, I, I guess maybe I don't have permissions to open the doors or something, because it ain't what happened for me. There's this elevator. Does this actually go anywhere? Yeah. Oh, now you're down here. There is no escape. While Litigator Esquire says, this is your life now. We are permanent members of the crew. Oh, that's how you get down. I just realized that this ship could fit two of my own ships in here. No problem. Dragon DS, what does that mean? It's a loner from the Banu Merchant Man. <laughs> part of the ship, part of the crew. Davy Jones. Oh, when you buy a ship that isn't released yet. So does that mean that if I did the upgrade to the Defiance, since it's not released yet, they would loan me a different ship? Loaner mate. This is a complicated game, just even in its like monetization scheme. You need a manual. <laughs> uh, okay, that that doesn't look good. So exit ship, here we go. Wait for it. Okay. I gotta say, I mean, yeah, this is this is laggy and buggy right now, but yeah, it looks like the bigger the ship, the uh, laggier it is. I clicked exit ship twice, but the elevator hasn't moved. Me too. Can I just kill ourselves? I'll try it one more time. Okay, I guess I'm gonna kill myself and respawn. Okay. <laughs> you have to die is so comical. They just flop over. Just collapse. I know you guys want to see Ember. We're working on an update. It's been a little bit slow because, you know, we've got a. Uh, our lead programmer Harry's on Burning Crusade vacation, so we've been doing a lot of artwork in the meantime. We just got oh, I I, I can't tell you this stuff. Oh, you know you, I can tell you this stuff. You know we're doing an art pass. We just got the new thing in that's been re-rigged and um, did a test animation for it that I'm pretty happy about. Just working out some final bugs with that animator's rig. Yeah, I know. I gotta be careful, Faye, not to spill the ketchup. 
Speaking of catch up, Ronan, I, I think we've been streaming almost three hours and we haven't done a single raffle. Maybe it's time to do like a catch up pack. Maybe a catch up pack, a dollar pack, and a newcomer pack. All right, let's start with the. Um, let's see, how do we want to do this? Based on popularity, let's begin with the dollar pack, go to the newcomer, and then land on the catch up pack. Can I go into someone else's place? Nope. <laughs> Alright, we're going back to the, the hot dog stand. Alright guys, for those who don't know how these raffles work, because we might have a couple new people in here today, we're going to do a little test to show you how it functions. First thing you're going to see is you're going to see a little sentence from Faye. Underneath that, there'll be a sentence from the Emberbot, and underneath that will be an emoji. It'll be a notepad with a pencil on it. When it's time to click it, you will click it. And that will put you in the running for whatever contest we are running at the moment. And, well, well Raph, not really contest. And so, uh, we usually have them go about 30 seconds, and uh, yeah, just click it once, put you in the running. And please remember, do not post while these are up. It'll be pretty simple. Yeah. All right, it's ready. Let's do that test one. On your marks, get set, click. Hey, RC5 is here. Everyone's got cat helmets. No wonder the cat girl is so popular for Ember. You got one too? No, no, how do we get a cat helmet? I want one. Probably, is there a place where you can buy clothing in this game? I'm guessing so. It won't be as cool as the uh, the clothing store in Ember. Congratulations again, Andriakos. You've won a second time. Ooh, that's a cool <laughs> helmet. What is that? This whole outfit's cool. You get face, thanks. <laughs> The odds for faith, thanks, have never been higher. That's true. Okay, you know what? It's time for that dollar pack. That dollar, dollar pack, y'all. So, anyone in here who doesn't know, some time ago we had something called Milestone 3. That was our, our third fundraiser for Ember. And during that time, we had, we had set it up where we were giving away a ton of prizes just for anybody who would sign up even a single dollar. So if you, if you signed up, just gave us a single dollar, there were a ton of stretch goals that you got for it. And guys, uh, the cool thing about that is that uh, even though that's passed, we had one of our members buy a ton of them so we could go ahead and give them out later. So we're going to do that right now. See if you would, show them the dollar pack along with all the prizes that they win. All right. Here is the pack along with the stretch goals. Why is there only a name tag over RC5's head, but not any other party member? I think that's because he's in our party and you're going us as in. Let's get in the elevator. <laughs> you have to pay for the name tag, Winter? If you want other people to see your name at all? Okay, you go ahead and unleash it when you're ready. <laughs> All right, you guys ready? Get your mouse clicks ready. On your marks, get set, click. As soon as I look at this shit, my game almost crashes. I'm frozen right now. Oh, really? Yeah, oh, I'm back now. This is another big ship. This looks is this as... Than that one, is this bigger than ship? the C2? One of its legs is twice as big as my ship. Holy crap. And the winner is... Allie Hunter. Congratulations, Allie Hunter. 
and congratulations, you win an M3 $1 pack. At the end of these uh, raffles, I will let you know what to do. <laughs> Pay attention to your messages, because Fay will probably tell you here momentarily. <laughs> Next up, we're going to do a new cover oh. pack. I think we'll do a Forerunner today. Yes? Did someone just die on the landing ramp? <laughs> So, Dragon Dios, are you okay? <laughs> oh, wait, I'm dead too. What? Oh, we all died. <laughs> Ghost Viper, you automatically get the stretch goal stuff, but to get access to the actual game, you'd need to either update, uh, upgrade it, or if you have a different pack from, say, a, a different thing like the newcomer pack that gives you access to the game, you would still get all of those stretch goals. So, the $1 gets you the stretch goals, but you'll need another way to make sure you actually get into the game. <laughs> okay, yeah. Faye, let's give these people a Forerunner pack. All right. There's what's in it. Are y'all ready to try and win it? On your marks, get set, click. Remember, if you've already won one, you can always gift it to a friend. I did a direct message by accident to Hangar 4. Okay, never mind. This is embarrassing. Did I do something to send one? FU says, hey, who was that? Not very nice of you. I don't know if I did anything. It's global chat. Could be anything. Hey, Data, right on, man. <laughs> Congrats. Ship's gone. So thank you for your work on the uh, VTuber. We appreciate it. <laughs> yes, thank you. So thank you for your work on the uh, VTuber. We appreciate it. <laughs> yes, thank you. And now it's time for the ketchups. The ketchup pack. All right, let's see those tomatoes, ketchup bottles, general packs of ketchup, and of course all you wacky people with your cucumbers and your bell peppers or whatever other random fruits and vegetables are bringing here. I mean, I'm supposedly weird for wanting to put pineapple on pizza, but you guys bring avocados to ketchup packs. I mean, who's the weird one, huh? <laughs> it is. It is delicious. <laughs> All right, do y'all want to see those lovely skins? See the skins. Out. There's so many now. I like this new sideways uh, version of the uh, graphic. I dig it. Yes, thanks to Whisper. Little help there. Whisper did something useful. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> the ramp killed us on the ship, so we all had to respawn. Now we're trying to get the ship back. <laughs> uh, eeny, meeny, 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 meeny,
fish. This is not close. To... All right, let's do this. Let's do this catch up pack. The fine job greeting whisper. <laughs> All right, you guys ready? On your marks. Get set. Click. Wow, for once, Toshi and I agree on something. <laughs> ah. <laughs> All right, we're back. Let's, like, not die this time. Too late now. It's been recorded, Toshi. It's been immortalized. The winner is Lone Wolf. Congratulations, you Lone Wolf. You get a ton of all these skins. You get a whole ketchup pack. And remember, if you already have a ketchup pack, you let me know, and I will make sure that someone else of your choosing actually gets it. And on that note, for those who don't know what to do, who haven't read the message, what you're going to do, you're going to send me a private message right away. I'm Ronan, and you're going to say, Hi, Ronan. I won a whatever it is that's won. Stay and then away from the death ramp. Yeah, Sorry. And, from the death. And, uh, <laughs> and give me your Ember ID that you use on myember.com. That is the magical ingredient that allows me to actually get you your packs. And thank you all for uh, enjoying uh, having a good time there with us on that uh, raffle. Grumps, back to you. Okay, so no running up the ramp. Running up the ramp is bad. Dies. Oh no, did I just die again? No, they retracted the ramp on me. <laughs> Thanks. See you later, guys. <laughs> Have fun storming the castle. <laughs> they left me to die. <laughs> oh my god, the interior of these ships are insane. It's like a mini city. You guys left me out here? <laughs> I was on the ramp, and then when you started closing it, I got I got bumped all the way back. There's like a there's a deck above the pilot seat. So are these standardized turrets, like these hard points, or are they unique per ship? I am not sure. Okay, here comes the ramp. I'm coming. I won't run up the ramp. I'm just running to the ramp. I'm going to the upper bridge right now. God, this is so cool. Even my game is dying. Cargo. Docking collar. This ship is pretty big. More cargo. So, so, for the record, despite every time I look at Star Citizen, I think to myself, man, I'd be bored. But then I'm like, ooh, the ship is pretty. <laughs> and, and I just want to buy one and just walk around in the ship going, ooh, it's terrible. <laughs> I think this is a forward, the forward turret, so I'm in the wrong place. Yeah, these ships are beautiful. I mean, they're, they're something. What are these, cryopods? Come to the upper bridge. This is really cool looking. All right. It's like Star Trek. I will try. Are we moving? Yeah, we're moving. Every time I, I see a ship video, they always talk about well compared to the Carrick. All right, do I want the cartography deck, technical deck, habitation deck, or sub deck? Uh, highest deck possible, I don't know. It's a deal, Hilvarius. I'm stuck in the sea. It's probably the wrong elevator. Whoa, okay. Great thing about the characters of the bay base was to set your spot on the bay base. Oh, um, 
I wish I did it earlier because I'm stuck on a chair oh. now and I can't move. I just fell through some flooring. No, I, I, I'm on the technical deck. I think that's the deck I'm on. I'm not sure. No, this is where like the engine room and stuff is, I think. Well, I see you on like the same level as I am, so just come listen to it as the door thing. I'm with RC5. Yep, and I'm, I'm stuck here in this chair. Oh, you're stuck in the chair? <laughs> I yeah, can see that. Yeah. Wow, okay, this ship looks amazing. Mm -hmm. The pilot stands? What is this? Oh, is it's it, like... It isn't even where the pilot is. Why are there joysticks here? Is there a secondary bridge? This reminds me of the uh, the ship in... Oh, what's the movie? Prometheus. Thanks, Darcy, for getting me out of that. I don't want to die. Well, there's a med bay. <laughs> well, I didn't say my spawn point at the med bay, though, so it's like... Yep, that would have been a long trip. Does this do anything, this terminal here, with the holographic loop? I don't know. It's cartography. We already have a star map in our wrist device. It, it certainly looks really cool, though. That's so cool. Like, I, yeah, I, like and then, and I can see why people like this ship. <laughs> I hope they're able to improve the performance, because this is pretty cool. Yeah, the performance is good. Sometimes it just drops to zero and it's like, mm. There are two bridges in the Kerak. Oh, my god, that's not up. Alright. Two bridges, huh? Oh, I just the bit here. I think it's the bit here. Whoa! Okay, I gotta sit. Weird's going on. There's a mirror here and I can't see myself in it. Am I a vampire? Sci-fi vampire. Witty says, I have a few more ships to explore. I can show you guys. That'd be cool, but I think we're three hours on the stream now. We actually have to end it pretty soon and get back to Ember stuff and all that goodness. Uh, this is probably a good stopping point. Yeah. Thank you, Dragon Diaz, for showing you the ships, showing us your ships, and uh, this has been this has been really cool. Thank you, Dita, for the wonderful rig for the VTuber avatar. I can't wait for the next one and the hot tub stream. Uh, we made fifty thousand credits already in Star Citizen. <laughs> the stream <laughs> thanks to dragon dios um and uh thanks to community too just uh, just putting up with our antics in star citizen <laughs> it's not ember whoa whoa okay we're whoa this thing's fast okay <laughs> it's highly maneuverable but this is cool i like star citizen i'm i'm glad to be a part of it again having rejoined after the Kickstarter. It's just an experience, you know? I think just just being able to have, even have a small ship and fly around here and just watch the scope of this ambition take place is pretty fascinating. But, uh... Yep, I think it's time for us to go. Thank you, everybody, for the wonderful stream. And, uh, I guess we'll see you in Star Citizen 2 at some point. I know I'll be, I'll be checking it out a little bit more. And, um, and we will have more Ember stuff for you next week. Do we have a new skin coming up from CSR? In 
just five days. It's going to be a doozy. I think everyone's going to love this one. All right, everybody. Take care. Thank you, everyone. Have a wonderful time. All right. Bye now.